That's my f***ing boyfriend. Jade and I are very serious about finding what they are. There was a couch and um, Will was bent over on the couch and Dwayne was standing up. Jaden Smith is no stranger to celebrity. Aside from being the son of megastars Will Smith and Jada Pinkett Smith, the 25-year-old actor and rapper has been performing since he was eight years old. He began his career in the 2006 film The Pursuit of Happiness, in which he co-starred with his father, and went on to star in films such as The Day the Earth Stood Still, The Karate Kid, and After Earth. He's also released three studio albums and a slew of hit singles, including his collaboration with Justin Bieber on Never Say Never. But it's Smith's one-of-a-kind personality and willingness to express himself openly in the face of conventional expectations and social norms that fascinates fans the most. His personality has also led many fans have questioned whether Jaden Smith is gay in recent years. Rumors about Jaden Smith's sexuality have been swirling for a while now, but Jaden has always been pretty vague about his S orientation, leaving his fans totally confused. Over the years, he has been linked to several other young stars such as Kylie Jenner, model Sarah Snyder, and actress Odessa Adlon. However, this has not stopped the fans from speculating as to whether or not he is gay. His fans strongly believe that Jaden is biased, especially due to the gay rumors that have circulated around Smith and rapper Tyler, the creator. The speculations began in 2018 when Smith made multiple public claims that the Who Dat Boy rapper was his boyfriend. During his set at the Camp Flog Na Music Festival, Smith opened up to his concert crowd and called Tyler, the creator, his boyfriend. I just want to say, Tyler, the creator is the best friend in the world and I love him so effing much," Smith said, and pointed to Tyler in the audience. Tyler doesn't want to say, but Tyler's my MFing boyfriend and he's been my MFing boyfriend my whole effing life. Smith continued to add excitedly, Tyler, the creator is my MFing boyfriend. It's true, if you take anything away from this effing show, that's what you take away. A few months later, Smith added fuel to the fire after Tyler, the creator won a Grammy Award for Best Rap Album. My boyfriend just won a Grammy, Smith proudly tweeted. What wasn't clear at the time, or even so now, was whether the After Earth actor was joking or serious about his relationship with Tyler. Neither performer has made a clear public statement about their relationship, leading to speculation among the media and fans. However, both personally and professionally, it is clear that the two actors are close. Smith talked about working with Tyler, the creator, in an interview with Zane Lowe for Apple Music's Beats One Inch last year. Man, I'm so happy to have this feature from him, Jaden said of Tyler's appearance on his single, Noise. It's the first time. It might be the most talked about song of the album. You have to hear Tyler's verse. People are going to listen to Tyler's verse, and they're going to come back and look at this, and they're going to think it's really funny. Listen to Tyler's verse. It's probably like, it's insane, I'm not gonna ruin it, but it's literally insane. People are not ready. And that's a fact. This is so far off guard. It's going to be hilarious. Tyler, for his part, has never publicly confirmed these rumors, largely ignoring them. It could be an inside joke between the two, or it could be a publicity stunt. As fans have noticed, the statements came out before the release of their new music. After all, Smith is known for being provocative, not only in fashion, but also on social media. Smith also hasn't been shy about expressing his gender fluidity. After all, it's what helped him establish himself as a fashion icon for the non-binary community. We can only say he's ambiguous about it. With the information we currently have, he could be on the LGBTQ plus spectrum. In 2016, he appeared in a pleated skirt and cool leather jacket for a Louis Vuitton women's wear campaign. He also created his own non-binary fashion line, MSFTS. In a 2016 interview with Variety, Smith said he created the line for the girl that wants to be a tomboy or the boy that wants to wear a skirt, and people try to condemn. We're here for you. Tell us your stories. If someone at your school is trying to pick on you, it doesn't matter because Jaden Smith's got your back. Smith also credited his famous parents with helping establish such a strong sense of self. My parents told me that the world was harsh and that we had to be strong within ourselves, he said. However, Jaden's dad, Will Smith, hasn't been thrilled by his stunts and jokes. A few years back, Will Smith started showing how he feels about his son, and in an interview he also told that he thinks Jaden is stupid because he doesn't know how to keep things secret in his life. When it comes to supporting Will Smith is not the one. 
However, this comes as a shocker to both fans and Jaden himself, seeing that Will has also been accused of allegedly having same S relations. For context, an individual named Brother Bilal made claims during an interview with Unwind with Tasha K that years ago, he walked in on Smith and Martin being intimate. There was a couch and um Will was bent over on the couch and Dwayne was standing up. In the interview, Bilal also seemed to allude to the size of Will's manhood, suggesting that Will is abnormally small. If a woman is used to something the size of a baby leg and you come in with a pinky toe, there is nothing you're gonna do to please her. If she itching for that baby leg, she want that baby leg, he said, referencing Jada Pinkett Smith. Anyway, Will Smith and Jada Pinkett Smith are once again denying claims of infidelity within their relationship. In a preview of an interview with Power 105.1's The Breakfast Club, the Red Table Talk host stated that she and her husband will take legal action against an alleged associate's claims that Smith had an intimate relationship with fellow actor Dwayne Martin. While discussing her new memoir Worthy, radio host Charlemagne the God brought up the No Soccer Mom chapter, where Pinkett Smith addresses rumors that have plagued her marriage, such as the couple, who have been married since 1997, being swingers or gay. Charlemagne asked the girls' trip actress how it feels to still have some of those same rumors out about people you love like Will and Dwayne in 2023. Breakfast Club co-host DJ Envy added that the rumor regarding Smith and Martin just came out. Let me just say this, Pinkett Smith began, it's ridiculous, right? And it's nonsense. And this is a person that tried a shakedown, a money shakedown that didn't work, Pinkett Smith said of Bilal. We're gonna take legal action, she said because it's one thing to have your opinion about somebody versus just making up salacious, malicious stories. So that's actionable. So we gone roll with that. As The Breakfast Club interview continued, Pinkett Smith maintained that the allegations are not true. According to the Madagascar actress, Bilal had previously worked with Smith on a book and felt he was not properly paid for his efforts. It's based around this person's idea that they, in some way, were doing business around Will's book and that they spent money, or what have you, and that they needed to be compensated. So he already tried to do this money shake down, she said. Will was willing to give him a certain amount, and he didn't take it. So this whole situation is based on that. Pinkett Smith said that she didn't know the details about the alleged business deal between Smith and Bilal, but added, like I told you, we bout to take legal action. A rep for Smith told People, this story is completely fabricated and the claim is unequivocally false. Anyway, for those who aren't aware of the Will and Dwayne situation, the two first met in 1993 on the set of Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, when Dwayne was featured in the episode entitled It Is Better To Have Loved And Lost It, and would go on to establish a nearly lifelong friendship that's now lasted for three decades. The pair of actors would frequently share the frame in pictures, and would often get spotted enjoying each other's company as the years went by, and they both continued to earn fame in Hollywood. Of course, as some might expect, their friendship and the close bond they shared has sparked rumors of an ongoing bromance, with many fans insisting that something romantic definitely stirred between Martin and Smith. For his part, Will Smith has been known to have little to no boundaries when it comes to engaging with other men. In fact, in 1993, when Will portrayed the role of a gay con artist in Six Degrees of Separation and coincidentally around the same time met Dwayne, the rumors about Smith's sexuality really lit up, with most fans taking an adamant stand on Will's homosexuality. During this early rise of gay rumors, both Dwayne and Will adamantly denied the claims, and as at the time, they were both married, quickly leading the rumors to die down. Around this time, in 1992, Smith married Cherie Zampino, though divorced the actress in 1995, only to marry Jada Pinkett two years later. Dwayne, on the other hand, dated Martin actress Tisha Campbell, and in 1996 they tied the knot. However, this wouldn't be the end of all the bromance rumors. In 2013, the hot topic concerning Will's S flared up yet again, this time because of an elusive answer provided by Jada during a candid interview with a well-known tabloid publication. During this time, rumors swirled that suggested trouble in paradise for the married couple. However, as everyone who followed the couple's history closely might know, they survived this troubling time in their relationship, only to end up sparking divorce rumors again nine years later. Anyway, during the interview, Jada responded to a tough question with a slightly vague answer in response to inquiring whether or not Will might be into men. She stated that she continuously encourages Will to be himself, saying that as long as he can look in the mirror and be happy with who he is, he should feel free to be just that, though insisted that she acts as his partner and that he should decide for himself. 
Although Jada seemed to try her best to avoid answering the question, insisting that Will answer it in person, people took her response as an elusive indication that Smith might be gay, which sparked widespread discussion. In any case, despite using his marriage to Jada to cover up his true orientation, Will Smith had an unfortunate slip-up. You see, Will gave Dwayne $1.4 million for his house in 2012. All this came into public knowledge when Dwayne and Tisha Campbell Martin filed for bankruptcy and then divorced. What's more, Will has also taken Dwayne on exotic trips. You see, in 2020, rumors of shipping Will and Dwayne once more made headlines because of an Instagram post by Dwayne's now ex-wife, Tisha, in which she shared a picture featuring a wise quote that alluded to the truth of always being victorious. The quote also states that lies only delay the inevitable, and rather unfortunately, her followers took it as a subliminal message pointing to her former husband's past behavior. Some suggestions concerning the post even went as far as insisting that Tisha called Smith out for allegedly being gay. With rumors literally running rampant, Tisha took to Twitter to try and quench as many fires as possible, stating that she would normally ignore any such rumors, but considered that things reached a point where it got seriously out of hand. Usually, I ignore negativity, but I'm tired of the media attacking the Smiths. They're an amazing couple, and I wish people would stop perpetuating lies and leave them alone," Tisha tweeted at the time. She also added in her tweet that all the rumors happened to be false, that the Smiths would not be divorcing, and that Will and Dwayne remain good friends. In any case, rumors of Will's sexuality have persisted for years, but a separate source claimed that Bilal's allegations have been particularly cutting for the family. These rumors are nothing new to Will and Jada, they told Daily Mail. What is new is that his friend for 40 years is saying this. Jada is phased by Bilal's statements because of his credibility and closeness to Will. The kids are obviously hurt by this, but nothing that comes out about their parents surprises them anymore. The insider went on to claim that Bilal's comments have been particularly hard for Jaden, who they claim had to hide his S for years because his parents were not having any of it. Anyway, as for Jada Pinkett Smith, many fans believe that she would be open to accepting Jaden as gay or bi seal. This is because Jada has had an almost similar conversation with her daughter Willow and her mother on the Red Table Talk. During the episode, Willow said, The history of marriage really irks me. Just the history of marriage as a whole and what it has represented over the years, for women in particular. With polyamory, I feel like the main foundation is the freedom to be able to create a relationship style that works for you and not just stepping into monogamy because that's what everyone around you says is the right thing to do," she continued. So I was like, how can I structure the way that I approach relationships with that in mind? The three women invited Gabrielle Smith, a polyamory advocate, to the show to discuss her practice of polyamory. It's not about, oh, I want to have all these partners, I want to do all of these things, Gabrielle Smith said. It's just like my S, I'm not specifically attracted to men and I'm not specifically attracted to women or any other gender, it's that I am open to anything, I want to be able to take opportunities if I feel like they're natural to me. Later in the program, Pinkett Smith said there is a lot of non-consensual non-monogamy going on because people will not just be honest. Jada then said to her daughter, As I said before, so long as you are having the greatest love affair with Willow, I don't care what you do. This was a huge green flag for the fans since they believed that Jada would respect and support her children's decisions. In any case, although Will Smith has never outrightly denied his children the right to be who they truly are, his reluctance to embrace Jaden's S says a lot about him as a father. Anyway, that's it for this video folks, bye.